<laughs> Horsing around pays off, but not just for Hollywood. June 15th. On this date in 1878, a handful of people representing the press were invited to the racetrack at Leland Stanford's Palo Alto stock farm to witness Edward Maybridge create a sequential series of photographs featuring horses in motion. Maybridge placed 12 cameras along the racetrack with their shutters automatically triggered as a cartwheel or the legs or breast of a horse tripped wires connected to an electromagnetic circuit. The resulting photographs were hailed worldwide as they showed that sometimes a horse has all four feet off the ground at the same damn time. But this happens when the feet are gathered under the horse's body in a gallop, and not when all four legs are extended, as most of these people were used to seeing, depicted in old paintings, so they were shocked. Some people were actually put off that the horse's movements seemed less graceful than they had believed. As motion photography became more widely used, people realized everybody moves like zombies in a still shot. Time out! I need to say how awesome slow motion photography is, and it never would have happened without the experiments done by Maybridge at the racetrack. The clowns at the Golden Arches want us to credit them with the slow-mo instant replay, but we can thank Maybridge and the horses, of courses. 100 mile an hour fastballs can't be tracked by the league's finest. And hockey goals can't be seen with the naked eye. So without slow motion, we just have to trust the umpire and the buzzer. Anyway, play ball, anyway. The photo series became the first example of chrono photography, photographing the passage of time or time-lapse photography. It was mostly used for scientifically documenting different phases of locomotion for study, but as my esteemed colleague attempts to point out, it was the basis for motion picture development and opened the faucet of technological advancements in the art and science of motion photography. Hashtag, if you love movies and slow-mo instant replay, thank a horse.